Hi, my name is Ahomuzi Amukanga, and I love math. I also want to learn about black woman mathematician. The purpose of my project is to learn more about black women in math, because I want to be a mathematician when I grow up. My hypothesis is that to be a mathematician, you need a degree in math all the way through college, and I believe women with math degrees can be very successful in jobs that can make a positive impact on our community. I am going to research the lives of the mathematicians Katherine Johnson, Evelyn Granville, Mary Jackson, and Martha Haynes. I will also interview the mathematician Arian Pathak. Currently, I am a professor of mathematics at Brookdale Community College and um, I also teach part-time at Rutgers University. So you really didn't know if it was going to get harder, 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 harder. I knew it would get harder, but I always felt like I it would be easy and I could figure it out easily. But it got to a point where it was very challenging for me. So <laughs> it wasn't as easy as it usually was. So I had to work a lot harder, a lot harder in order to succeed. I want to be a teacher when I grow up too. Oh, that's awesome. We need more great uh, women teachers and great teachers of color. So that would be awesome. How many other black women or black men have been, uh, especially your master's program, obviously I felt like everybody was black, right? Yeah, but then at grad school, it was me. I walked, it was just me. Uh, so yes, when I um, started my graduate school program, there were no other people of color in the department. So I was the only black person, but the department had a big push for diversity. The, there was a professor in a department who worked with this program called EDGE, um, but being a person of color and especially a woman um, with a mathematics degree, when you go into a lot of different spaces, you won't find a lot of people that look like you, but things are getting a little bit better. Um, and that's one of my passions, uh, even to this day, um, at the schools that I work at, I work with the women in STEM clubs um, to, encourage women to you know keep pursuing these higher degrees so that when we go into these spaces we see more people like us. I researched very cool women mathematicians. Katherine Johnson was the first black woman to graduate from West Virginia State. Evelyn Granville created a computer program to analyze satellite orbits for NASA. Mary Jackson became NASA's first black female engineer. Martha Haynes is the first woman of African descent in America to earn a PhD in math. This is my data. In conclusion, my hypothesis was correct. A math degree is the way to go. My Nguzu Saba principle is Nia because these women have purpose.